What's good YouTube? Ryan Babs here, back with another video. In the parking lot at work, sitting in the Jeep, about to go in. It looks a little muddy, muggy outside, but it is what it is. Um, I just wanted to come on here and talk about, um, this is a video of me talking to you guys in front of the camera because there's something I wanted to, I, want, I do want to talk about now that I can officially talk about it, I can. So let's just go ahead and get into it. So the last couple months, the last month or two, I've been hinting at something that I haven't been able to talk about. Well, now I'm going to talk about it simply for the mere fact that um, I'm not going to be able to pull it off. And what I was planning on doing was um, hosting a two day card show here in the Little Rock area is what I was planning on doing. Um, after like running all the numbers, everything made sense. I, I, I could have pulled it off, but uh, the problem, there was a couple problems and I definitely feel like I could have been profitable off this, um, off this event. But the issue is that I didn't want to have, I didn't, I didn't have the capital up front. I'm not going to be able to get all the capital up front that I need to book the venue and all that. Um, and I didn't want to put myself in a bind trying to pull this off, even though the, like it would have paid off in the end, I think. But, um, so I kind of feel bad about it. Uh, Cause I did tell a few people that I was planning this and I was like, like leading up to it that um, I was going to do this and I was, and, um, like we got to like, I always got to the point to where I got to almost sign the contract. And then right when I got the contract, I backed out, um, kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, so to people I did tell about it, I apologize feel like a failure feel like I let people down I'm gonna feel like I'm letting you guys down by not being able and this is not I didn't even want to make this video but I feel like I needed to just to get it off my chest but you know what um, we learned a lot I now know what I have to do in order to do this event on a minimum scale and I, I, I don't think I was gonna be able to create my vision with the timeline given um they wanted a tentative agenda six months out we're, we're less than six months out because it was going to be the weekend of june 11th and 12th so i was talking to chase i was talking to my my guy shadowless talking to my guy brandon um they're like you know it's honestly not like they told me like like hey not even feel, don't even feel bad about it it is what it is you got to do what's best for your business you got to do what's best for you um, 2022 just focus on building up that capital building up that point to where getting your name out there building your brand to where you can put on this event now is it now could something happen yes yeah, something could happen I might put it on late 2022 that's one of the things I wanted to do in 2022 is host a card show I might have to wait to 2023 but it is well like I said but it is what it is. I learned a lot from this, from, just from even planning this, I learned a lot. Um, I learned what it costs to get some people to come out to sign autographs. Cause I, that's expensive. Um, I learned that you have to have insurance for an event. That's expensive. Um, hang on a second. Yeah, I learned that you have to have insurance for an event. I didn't even know that was a thing until now. That's, a, that's not expensive. Actually, that, was, that's not, that wasn't bad. That was actually feasible. Um, what else did I learn? Like I said, I learned how much it cost. Um, I learned how much planning is involved and what all has to be done on that. Um, I really think I could have been successful with it, but I think part of the problem was is I couldn't say anything until it was official and it was all, I had to be hush hush. And had I been able to promote and try to get tables sold, I think it would have been a lot easier to promote. And, um, it is what it is. I just wanted to come on here and get that off my chest, but you know what? I'm excited for 2022. I'm excited to just be able to put it up and just keep it going, keep this thing going. So anyways, guys, 
I'm going to get off here. Go inside. Thanks for listening. I will see you guys in the next one.